The teenager Gaia Pope, whose body was found 11 days after she went missing from a seaside town, had not suffered any injuries that would suggest murder, detectives have said. A post-mortem has taken place but the cause of 19. Year old Pope's death may not be known for some time as toxicology and other tests are being carried out. Specialist police search teams found a woman's body on Saturday afternoon on a craggy stretch of coast on the Isle of Purbeck in Dorset, not far from where the items of clothing belonging to her were found on Thursday. An important line that the police are following is the state of Pope's physical and mental health when she went missing from Swanage on the 7th of November. Pope disappeared without the drugs she needed to treat her epilepsy and family and friends have said she was feeling stressed about a traumatic event that happened about two years ago. Her family vowed on Sunday to get justice for her. Day Superintendent Paul Kessel, of Dorset Police's major crime investigation team, said, the post-mortem examination has not identified any injuries to suggest any other person was involved in her death. The cause of death is undetermined pending toxicology. The coroner is involved in the oversight of these examinations but at this time this remains an investigation into an unexplained death. We would like to take this further opportunity to pass our thoughts to Guy's family. I would like to pass our thanks to the public volunteers and partner organizations who have supported this inquiry throughout and have been material in locating Gaia. The area where the body was located is likely to remain cordoned off for some time while forensic examinations and searches are concluded. Please can I ask that the public no longer attend to assist with searches and that they remain a safe distance from the location. I reiterate this area is steep and slippery in an exposed area close to sea cliffs. The area is covered in dense undergrowth and gorse and can present a hazard. Only specially trained search and forensic teams are entering the area assisted by Dorset and Wiltshire Fire and Rescue Service recovery teams. The tributes to Pope flooded in on Sunday. Her sister Maya Pope Sutherland described her as my everything. Writing on Facebook she added, can't find any words right now. I am heartbroken I thank everyone who was involved in searching for my beautiful twin. Going to make her so proud. Her sister Clara said she would continue to speak of her in the present tense and called her the absolute light of my life. She added, so beautiful, so emotionally wise and intelligent and so passionate and artistic and creative and understanding. Her cousin, Mari E. Pope Weidman, said, my beautiful baby girl, so sunny and kind but tough. We hold you in our hearts forever. Know you are with Nan and Pops now but miss you beyond words. You will have justice. Fly on Pope was remembered at church services across Dorset and beyond while floral tributes were left and candles lit at the foot of a monument on the Swanage seafront. One card said, Our hopes now replaced with sadness, may you rest in peace Gaia, this town will never forget you XX.